Our next question comes in as a live dictation, Pastor Carl. It is from Richard out of Charlotte, North Carolina, and he would like to know, as a young pastor, he has heard many people talk about pastor burnout. Is there any advice that you could offer him or any other young pastors? Well, Richard, I'm glad you called, and I try to give special attention and focus to pastors. They call the church. Many call my private line because I simply... Uh, was able to introduce them to Christ, maybe as students and in other capacities, and they've had my phone number for 30 years, and so they'll call, and and I want to help young pastors especially because they're the next generation of leaders. I would say first and foremost, you need to watch over your own heart with all diligence, for from it come the issues of life. And so ministry can get especially taxing. Uh, Last week, it was intensely busy for me, I wanted to have three hours with my grandson on Saturday, but that meant a late Saturday night. It meant Sunday when I came in. I arrived here in this building at 6.15 in the morning, and I was uh, here until late at night uh, trying to finish everything I needed. I was going to take Monday, and I thought, oh, I'll just, I've got to get this handout done for Wednesday. But then I said, no, I'm violating my own rules. You need one day and seven to rest. And God created the world in six days, and in one day he rested, not because he was tired, but he was setting an example for us of our need for rest. We know that from, among other passages, Exodus chapter 20. And so let me just read Exodus chapter 20 to you. Um, Moses is really giving some divine commentary here in the Decalogue.